Hello and welcome to Red Live. So, social media influencer as well as DJ Cyan Bougie has finally spoken out about what caused the altercation. And also, you know, she came through, thanked her fans for all the support that she's been getting in on social media. And yeah, she also does say in the video that she has opened a case. So yeah, about an hour or so ago, Cyan Bougie posted a video and captioned it. Also, I failed to understand what I'd possibly achieve from sabotaging their establishment as they claim. This is my end. So yeah, let us take a listen to Cyan Bougie's side of things. Hi guys, I hope you guys are having a good day. Um, firstly, thank you to every single person that has supported me throughout this tough time. The interaction on my previous post about what has transpired um, in the early hours of today and um, the messages in the DMs, I really appreciate it. So I wanted to inform you guys that I have opened a case. I'm currently at the police station in Mamelodi East. I've opened a case against the person that has attacked me and my team, which is the owner of Konabucha. And I also want to clarify just two things. There are two stories that are circulating. Firstly, there was no point in time where I fought with any girl about any guy. And there was no point in time where I fought with an artist. There was no artist there except me. So um, I also want to say that the main reason why we had gotten into a fight with this person was because he had to pay us he owes us money from two of the gigs we had with him and he hasn't paid from forever so my manager tried to approach him and that's when everything just went south so i just want to also say that immediately after we got out because there's a video that's circulating where i got attacked but after that we still got attacked outside of his um shop so yeah that was just a quick update of this whole situation and thank you so much i really appreciate you guys um everything will be handled in court so there you have heard it from Cyan Bougie herself. She still got that five finger, you know, on her face over there. You know, definitely hope her a speedy recovery. Ish, yeah, nah, someone slept a real bad over there. But yeah, at the end, she does say thank you so much. You are welcome so much. And uh, yeah, hopefully she does handle things in court and not outside of the court. If you guys know, you know. But yeah, that is basically Cyan Bougie's side of things. And as always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Real Live if you haven't. And binge watch my previous videos.